Hey everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to todayatfeellike.com. Today I have a very special product that I'm going to review that I think I'm going to love. And this is an electric wine opener. And you guys know I love my wine. So anyhow, this is from a company that I cannot even begin to pronounce the name. The name is FGXJKGH. I don't know if that's even a word or just a series of letters they threw together, but that's who makes it. We're going to check it out. Here we go. All right, everyone, before we actually go ahead and test out this electric wine opener, let's unbox it, see what comes inside with it and check that out. All right, so here we go. This is the electric wine opener right here. Let's actually uh, take the lid off the box here so we can see what comes with it. And we can see right away there's some instructions here. Um, there we go. There's the English instructions on this side there. So that's nice to have. And we will set that off to the side. And then here is everything. So there's a bunch of stuff in here. Um, this is a wine cutter uh, or excuse me, a foil cutter right here. So this is going to cut the foil uh, for, your, uh, for your wine. And we'll set that off. This looks like this is going to be a wine pour. So there we go. We can take this out. And this is where you put this in the bottle top right there. And then you can pour out of here. So it's sort of a wine pour. It looks like it might be a little bit of an aerator on there as well. And then this here, let's see what this is. This looks like it's going to be a vacuum, um, a vacuum um, sealer. So you might be able to uh, see how that pulls out and then pushes in there. So that's going to be a vacuum uh, stop there so that you can, um, you can uh, plug up your wine bottle when you're not using it. So uh, if you haven't finished it. So, and then this right here is the actual, um, the actual wine opener right here, the actual electric wine opener. So um, I'm not sure, I'm sure it needs batteries. I'm not sure uh, exactly how this works. So we'll have to see, it feels like this top comes off somehow. So I'll have to see if I can get this top off and, oh, yep, there we go top comes off and there are some instructions there for the batteries. It looks like uh, it needs, it looks like it needs uh, four double A batteries. So we'll have to get some double A's and uh, put that in there. So, and then, um, and then once we have them in there, we will, uh, we'll test this thing out and see how it does. But here are a couple of the buttons there that you use to, uh, to either the bottom, I believe is to uh, use the drill here to remove the cork. And then the top one is the one to release the cork. So, um, yeah, this is, uh, this looks like it's going to be pretty cool so far. So anyways, I just need to get some batteries and then we will try this thing out and actually see how it performs. All right. So there we go. We were able to see what comes in the box. And so let's jump into the good and the bad. And the first good thing up that I want to mention is that it comes with a lot of accessories to actually make the overall experience of using it even better. So as we saw with the unboxing, it comes with a foil cutter. It comes with a wine pour and it comes with a vacuum seal. So it comes with all those extra accessories besides just the wine opener to make your overall experience of using the wine opener that much better. So now this next good thing is that the electric wine opener, it's just very, very easy to use. It just is, it's fantastic. You just simply place it over top of the center of the cork, push a button, hold on to it tightly and let it do its thing. And that's it. It opens it up, it grabs the cork, it goes ahead and drills on in, pulls the cork out, and then you are ready to start enjoying your wine. Now this last good thing that I want to mention is, is that once the cork is actually pulled out of the bottle and you want to remove it from the wine opener, all you have to do is just push another button. That's it. It actually starts to go ahead and turn and release the cork. So you don't have to worry about trying to manually screw it off or yank it out. You just push another button and it releases the cork and then you are all finished and you are able to enjoy your wine and yeah, get your drink on. All right. So now on to the bad. And there is only one bad thing that I want to mention, and that is I wish that this electric wine opener actually made the wine for me so I didn't have to go out and buy it. So no, but not, in all seriousness, I don't really have any complaints about this electric wine opener. It comes with lots of accessories that are very cool to use. The device itself works really, really well. 
and I just don't have anything bad to say about it. So anyhow, I'm gonna leave a link to this product in the video description right down below so that you guys can check it out. I'm also going to leave a link to my Amazon page so that you guys can see all the products that I've reviewed over time and you guys can get any of those that you like. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and follow me on Facebook. And I am Larry with todayifeellike.com. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.